In the news and developing this morning, Prince George's County firefighters are still on the scene of a massive fire in College Park. Now, the flames broke out nearly 24 hours ago at an apartment building that was under construction. It caused nearly $40 million in damage and was the largest fire in recent history in the recent history of the Prince George's County Fire Department. Fox 5's Melanie Alwick is live in College Park with the latest on this story. Mel? Good morning, guys. Yeah, this eventually went to five alarms, 200 firefighters responding from uh, agencies around the area to try to battle this massive blaze. Uh, it is at this point a total loss. There is still a concern now about collapse, not only because of so much structural damage, but also because of the massive amounts of water that have just been pumped into that building. Now, yesterday, I talked to two construction workers who were in the building when the fire broke out. They gave me some pictures and video of what it looked like. Uh, Right about 9.35, that was 9.36-ish, that's right when Prince George's County Fire Department got the call and responded here to the scene. There's a, there's a firehouse here, literally just around the block. And you can see they're saying it started like right near the sixth floor, the elevator shaft on the sixth floor. But despite their best efforts, firefighters, 60 minutes later, the video speaks for itself. You can see what it looked like. Alarms were sounded to pull all of the firefighters out of the building, and crews could do nothing more than to attack it from the outside. The building is a city block long. It's called the Fuse 47 Project, 250 apartments, retail stores, a parking garage. It was about three-quarters of the way completed, and uh, that is also uh, some of what contributed to the problem. And it took a massive effort to even try to battle this blaze. We did uh, use uh, the police helicopter, Air One, uh, that was able to uh, get up and give us an aerial view where um, their um, video was streamed into this vehicle here. So we got a pretty good uh, idea of what was burning. Now, smoke was also a problem. A thick smoke just hung all around the Route 1 College Park area, even filling parts of the University of Maryland campus. It was forced to close yesterday after 1 p.m. Also, some senior citizens had to be relocated as well to areas where they could get some fresh air. The University of Maryland campus is scheduled to open on time today. The cause of this fire still under investigation. Live in College Park, I'm Melanie Alnick, Fox 5.